Are you ready to see the most polished, the most amazing, the best FPS game you've ever seen? Well, you're in the wrong place because this is trash. What the hell is this? This is the game so far. And as you can see, we've got movement, um, just basic FPS movement. And we've got some zombies following us. As you can see, they can't really come up here. And yeah, the movement is pretty, really basic right now. It's just whatever I cobbled together from my memory of using Unity from years ago. And um, for some reason, there's like velocity. You can see I'm like moving slowly. But yeah, I've not been really bothering with things that I don't understand. And I'm trying to like do as many multiple things as I go and getting lots of things done instead of really polishing everything and then moving on to the next thing. Because I feel a lot of people get stuck in that. They try and do one thing and they try and make it like as good as possible, as good as they've seen in other games. And then when they're not able to do that, they get discouraged. And then when you look at what you've been doing, you haven't actually really done much. But if you do stuff, you know, small bits and pieces, the best you can with um, the knowledge you have, and you move on to the next thing. When you look back, it feels like you've done a lot more, even if it's not all super polished yet. So yeah, it looks terrible, but um, that's okay for now. Um, so there's movement, there's jumping, there's sprinting, stuff like that. And um, there are these three zombie spawns here, these cylinders, and these zombies randomly spawn at those places and they follow you around using nav mesh and nav mesh agent. So that's all built into Unity, which is pretty cool. And yeah, you can see my really rudimentary HUD. It's literally just some text there. Um, no fancy elements yet or UI design or whatever. Um, but you can see that on the left side, we've got like information about the game and my health. And if I let these guys touch me, uh, you can see that they take some health from you, uh, which is pretty cool. And on the right side i've got information about my gun and my beautiful gun model which you can definitely tell is not just a cube <laughs> um, and you can also switch guns so it says the name of the gun right now there's only three so there's semi auto bolt action and auto so obviously with auto if i hold you can see i'm doing damage and um lovely falling animation and then the zombie bodies disappear after a while uh, and yeah, then they spawn again and now it's the next round and I'm out of ammo. So I press R to reload and yeah, you can see that I do more damage on the head of the zombie as well. Um, and there's hit markers and the damage text. And then for the semi gun, I can tap fire and it does more damage than the automatic cause it's, um, I guess more effort to shoot <laughs> and yeah. And then, um, obviously the level right now is just super basic. I have put no effort into that. Just getting mechanics ready first, and then I'll get into actually designing a level. And this is just me playing around with, um, pro builder, which is unity's built in modeling tool, which has been actually surprisingly cool. What the heck? How does that even happen? Oh my. Okay live demo that's what you get um but yeah it's been surprisingly cool i use blender um and i used it a lot before when i did unity like six years ago but um blender can be pretty hard pretty steep learning curve and this pro builder is actually quite easy to pick up and quite easy to work in and iterate quickly so that's cool you can see everything happening right inside your game engine no yeah, the animation is a bit trash. It seems like um, if I kind of go inside the room or up the stairs, then the falling animation breaks. Um, so I don't know what that's about, to be honest. It's a bit, it's a bit weird. Uh, but yeah, there will always be bugs and um, we'll have to fix them some other time. 
So yeah, and obviously the shooting right now is really trash. It's just ray casting. Ugh. Uh, ray casting to see where I'm shooting and to yeah, um, yeah see if I'm hitting the zombies. Uh, which look like really weird tic-tac minions right now with cube heads. Um, but yeah. As you can see here, I'm not no expert uh, 3D modeler. I'm actually uh, uh, um, god tier. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I'm hopefully we'll get better over the course of this game. And yeah, I'm looking forward to learning more about modeling and uh, things like that. But you can see I really am extremely bad at Blender now. I used to be okay. Um, but yeah, opening it now after like five, six years, interface has completely changed. I don't remember anything. So yeah. <laughs> hey guys, just wanted to thank everyone for watching my first devlog. Um, and yeah, I'll be making more as I go along and learning more and sharing with you guys and hopefully inspiring some people. So please give it a like and a comment. Let me know what you guys want to see. And maybe even if you have ideas, cause I'm not really, um, strictly trying to recreate COD zombies. And I've been seeing a lot of cool things around like medieval zombies or like vampire fighting and things like that. So I may change up the formula a bit and yeah. Um, Hope you guys are excited and look forward to it. Thanks for watching.